We're very excited to welcome Harry Angel back for his fourth and biggest season here at Kelvin Side. World champion sprinter and highest rated sprinter to retire to Southern Britain for 30 years. To put it in context for our market here, his time form rating is higher than three Everest winners, Red Zell, Yes 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 and Classic Legend. He's the fastest son of champion sire Dark Angel, a stallion that started off very modestly and now stands for 60,000 euro in Ireland. Dark Angel was leading sire of two-year-olds in Europe in 2021, ahead of Wooten Bassett, Memis and Frankel, in order of prize money. He won the Group 2 Mill Reef Stakes as a two-year-old at only his second start. He continued his winning form as a three-year-old, winning the Group 1 July Cup, beating Caravaggio and the Tin Man, among others. It's Harry Angel that wins the July Cup! He followed this up with a victory in the Group 1 Haydock Sprint Cup, leaving Blue Point and Tassleed in his wake. And Harry Angel, a class apart, wins the 32 Red Sprint Cup. He also added the Group 2 Sandy Lane Stakes to his tally as a three-year-old, setting a new course record. There's a theme beginning to emerge here. Harry Angel was very fast. As a four-year-old, he contested three Group 1s and won the Group 2 Duke of York Stakes. He retired sound and joined the stallion ranks at Dallam Hall Stud. It's been encouraging to see that Harry Angel has had a very promising start to his stud career in the North. Also notable, his first three winners are out of mares with a distinctly Australian flavour to their pedigrees. Those being mares by Encosta de Lago, Star Spangled Banner and Exceed in Excel. This would indicate that Harry Angel is likely to suit a wide range of mares in the Australian broodmare population. Breeders that supported Harry in his first season reaped the benefits at the yearling sales this year. Toryburn Stud sold a very nice colt to Roughwood Park for 460,000. Named Monte Braveheart, he's in training with Luke and Robert Price, so will be given every opportunity. Atanga Stud sold another nice colt to Bill Bain in Queensland for 380,000. He's in training with Billy Healy on the Sunshine Coast. Other trainers with Harry Angel progeny in their care include Chris Waller, Snowden Racing, Friedman Racing and Mark Newman. And of course, James Cummings. No shortage of good trainers there. Harry Angel stands at Kelvin's side at a fee of 16,500, including GST.